skadoosh, skadoosh. Welcome back to the channel, my ninjas. We got Guilds of Ravnica bundle. We haven't done that yet on the channel. Kind of a little behind on that one. And then we have Guilds of Ravnica pre-release pack. I want to give a quick shout out. To my boys over at Insanity Gaming and Collectibles. You can check them out on their Facebook group. Uh, simply just by searching their name. Insanity Gaming and Collectibles. Uh, and also, big old shout out to my homie Marcus Wood. Marcus Wood is a loyal patron of the channel. And a member of my Ninja Squad. Actually, there is a way to become a member of the Ninja Squad. It's a... Uh, it's a feature where you could support in the, uh, how do you do it? I don't even know. It's something new, but it def this, this blade's not sharp enough. It needs sharper. But it's a feature on YouTube now where you can uh, support the channel without going to Patreon or anything uh, for like a couple bucks a month, I guess. Check that out. It should be like a, an option somewhere. I'm not sure. Maybe in the video or maybe, I don't know. I don't know where it's located, but it's somewhere on the channel. And then also, we're going to give away from the Mythic Edition booster box. I have selected a person. It's right here, baby. All three of those cards. I'm going to announce that winner. And also, Wayne Baker, my homie, he sent me something. We're going to check that out, too, and see what he's got in there. First things first, let's get to cracking open. Ooh. Oh, my God. Don't steal. Bad shit will happen to you. You end up grabbing your ankles because this big dude behind you told you so. You don't want none of that shit. Stay in school, kids. Magic the Gathering Arena book. So you get one of these little booklets in here. Tells you a little bit about the game and about the guilds, I would assume. And gives you a little index of all the cards that are available in the set. Pretty nifty stuff. And you get a box, which I always end up tossing in the trash. And you get another box, which I end up keeping when I ship stuff to patrons. Oh, we have a build the deck basics. What's in here? Nothing. That's it. That's it. That's how you get a little instruction on how to do it. That's different. And then we get a big old land pack. That's a foil land on top? When did they start doing that? When did they start doing foil land? They're not all foils, are they? That'd be ridiculous. They're not all foils. I don't know. I feel like I got to open that now. Why is there a foil land on top? That is completely new. Let me get an eight. Six. Way off. All right, let's get the crack and open, Captain. Let's see what's up inside Guilds of Ravnica booster packs. Maybe get something juicy, I don't know. Yeah, but I asked your guys' opinion. Uh, give me your thoughts on what you think of the Mythic Edition booster box. And the price of those things is still pretty ridiculous and through the roof, so... Like, Gary Finebroker, one of those popular cards used in the format, with Mausoleum Secrets. This card has plummeted in value, but I do see it going back up. I'd say if any time is the time to buy that... Probably be now. I can't see it being a very expensive tutor. But, I mean, I can see in time, you know, five to ten bucks down the road. But right now, it's just... Uh, someone's got to build a deck, and then it kicks butt, takes numbers, and there you go. Quasi-duplicate, all up in the house. What a dimmer gate, or Demer, Demar. Why can I never say that? That is up inside every single pack. Someone's like, there's no basic lands in here? Nope, there's absolutely not. Uh, inside of packs, but you can pull the guild gates in every single pack which is pretty nifty i guess we got a silent dart and a watery grave starting things pretty good we will take a watery grave as you know these are uh sought after dual lands uh they do make uh your your time playing the game better more efficient getting the card out quickly paying two life just to tap a uh tap for a swamp or island turn one's pretty cool the Delkin Mesmerist is our foil. We'll take it. We got a foil. I'm loving it, baby. With a bird illusion token in the back. Today's going to be a double drop video. Make sure you just punch that like button in the face uh, just for that sake. And then, uh, yeah, we'll be doing more stuff. There you go. Mur Murmuring Mystic. I'm also thinking about going back to uh, Twitch for a little bit. So there's that. Night of Autumn. Pretty cool. Pulled that quite a bit lately. This has been a really solid uh, bundle so far. This fat pack is not doing bad at all. Got the sure strike. Cause I figure like I just spend so much time um, recording videos uh, or arena. I might as well. That's a my favorite artwork right there. I might as well just start Ritual of Soot. I might as well just start uh, going live on Twitch and then taking the good stuff and putting it on YouTube uh, from what I get from that. So let me hear your thoughts on that one as well. I think that'd be the, the route to go, though. 
I just I don't believe I'd be uh, as interactive. I wouldn't interact with the audience as much on Twitch um, because I'm making a, you know I'm trying to work on decks and all that and. For a video sake of putting it on YouTube, if I'm just sitting there interacting 24-7, a lot of people get irritated with that if there's no, you know, you can't see the comment section. And I think I'd make it something like that. But at least it's a way where you guys can watch live. And there'll be some, there'll be slight interaction, you know, but I'm not going to be responding to comments left and right. Um, like I would on a YouTube live stream. Justice Strike, Thought Erasure, Renewal, and a Legion War Boss. Solid. Very solid. Very, very solid, baby. So yeah, there you go. Now you know. Now you have it. What else is up in here? We got the old harpooner with a book devourer. I think we got a, a foil in here. World Soul. Beast Whisperer. Good. I, I couldn't find any of my Beast Whisperers. Like, they all, like, hide? They all hid? I don't know. Ledev Guardian. But now I have one. Yay. Because one of my patrons was wondering about this. Like, you got any Beast Whisperers? And I'm like, I should have Beast Whisperers, but I couldn't find any of them. We now have one. There is that. And we got Necrotic Wound, Inescapable Blaze, Unicorn, and Dawn of Hope. Pretty neat card. Great way to draw cards, I'll tell you that much. Last but not least, what will we get inside? Last pack to crack, baby. We got the Conclave Tribunal. Really cool removal. Another fine broker, contraband, and Arc Light Phoenix Mythic to close it out. We will take that. I'd say this was a, a very. Oh yeah, we also got the emblem. We also got the emblem over here for Vraska. There you go. So that goes in that pile. Pretty good. Pretty darn good right there. Um, let's crack open what Wayne Baker sent really quick, and then we'll open up this Guild of Ravnica pre-release kit. Find out what goodies are inside. Wayne, thanks for sending this out, my dude. I gotta pull this back, make sure there's no addresses on here and what have you. Let's see. It does not look like it. Alright, Joey Moss, what's good, my brother? I've been watching your videos for a few years. Nice. And they always give me a good laugh. Or make the vibe of life a lot chiller. I've been wanting to be able to become a patron, but don't got the means to do so. Hence the $2 in the envelope. Okay, so you, okay, I get it. Anyway, just thought I would send a few cards from my collection to add to your collection. Hope all finds you well. Thank you for your skadooshing. Thank you, my skadoosh bag. Uh, content as always, PLA, Wayne Baker. P.S. Good luck to your future videos and channels that uh, you're in. Keep the good vibes going. That's right, I am. I do appear in other videos and other channels, more uh, like in real life kind of stuff. Uh, ghost Static, you can check that out. Good old Ghost Static. Two bucks. Two bucks. I thought that was for return shipping. Let's see what we got up in here. Trigon of Corruption. Really cool set. Scars of Mer uh, Meriden, uh, Meriden, sure. Really, really good set. Really good set. Origin Spell Bomb, legit. Soraka, Mor it's Marauder, guys. It's Marauder. Don't you ever forget that. It's Marauder. <laughs> Uh, Shatter Skull Giant. Giant Warriors legit. Some older stuff here. Hedron Scrabbler. Followed by a Thought Scour. Love that artwork. And I know you knew that. You already knew that. That's, that's been featured in a video. Thank you very much for sending that out, my ninja. I do appreciate it. Wayne, you the man. Let's get to cracking. Actually, I want to see this really quick. What is up with this forest down here? Do you, it, it, it can't be all foils. If it's all foils, I'll, I'll die. It's got to be just one, right? Whoa. We got, okay, maybe one of each. So we got a foil forest, a foil mountain, a foil swamp, a foil island, a foil plains. Wow, okay, that's kind of cool. Yep, that is it. Okay, <clears throat> I had to check that out. I didn't know they did that. Do they? I'm going to have to check some other guys' uh, videos out and see if that's common practice there. I'm not really sure. Uh, also, let's announce that winner. Mythic Edition. I asked your guys' thoughts on Mythic Edition. One person and one person said, uh, and that's Handsome Yak. Can't really see that. Handsome Yak, make sure you email me at mossbergswerve at gmail.com. It's M-O-S-B-E-R-G-S-W-E-R-V-E -E -E at gmail.com. And you're getting this Knight of Autumn, Risk Factor, and Venerate Loxodon, which I signed. There you go. Uh, just make sure you hit up my inbox, or uh, yeah, my email. Um, but one, they, uh, I asked the question, what are your thoughts on Mythic Edition? And he responded, I think they should have put those Planeswalkers as masterpieces in the Guilds of Ravnica set. And hats off, sir, I believe they should have done the exact same thing instead of being Hasbro greed monsters. 
So that is that. All right, let's get to cracking open this sun gun <clears throat> really quick. There we go. Again, shout out to Insanity Gaming and Collectibles on Facebook. Make sure you guys check them out. We got Secret Shadow Silence. And we got some goodies. We are going to flip this upside, Dizzle. Not sure what we got there. And let's crack open these Magic the Gathering Guild Ravnica packs. Can we get crazy lucky with these? Man, I need a trash can. Mine's overflowing right now. This is no joke. I, I will show you my trash can. Uh, we got the Mage, the Lava Coil, Stalwart, and a Response Resurgence. Nice, nice. What is it, Gate? What the is it, Gate? That's a Guilds of Ravnica pack. This one feels light. Or maybe my hands are just heavy. I'm not sure. That was weird. Uh, we got the Guild Pact, followed by Colossus, Unicorn, and the Sentry. Not bad. I don't expect that Sentry ever to see much play or value. But then again, who really knows? Who really knows? As long as, if someone can make a nasty deck and it all ends up working, I mean, that's what spikes card value, is when someone puts together the deck. Got the Banneret, the Shaman, it's Nullhide Ferox. Welcome to the party. I had a patron eat up all my uh, Nullhide Ferox's. So, we got some more, baby. We got one more. Nice. Cracking up this sucker. See what we got. We got the Summit, followed by the Battle. Phantasm, cool card. And nice, uh, Niv Mizzet Power Room. This recently went up in value, so not too shabby there. And also, if you're thinking about becoming a patron, now is the month to do that. Because next month, I'll be giving away at random one of the Mythic Edition Planeswalkers. That is correct. One of them is going out. Uh, one patron will win. Pretty crazy. Beast Whisperer at the end. All right, not bad. we got two Beast Whisperers now. Go figure. Pretty sweet. Let's roll up the die, see what we get inside. Give me a six. Fourteen. Horse crap. Man, I was way off. What we got up in here? What did we get? What did we get? Boosh! Atrata the Silencer. Nice. The Vampire Assassin. That is legit. I'm almost tempted to leave it in here because we already know what's all in here. You just get the, the foil promo and then a bunch of uh, uncommons and common cards out the back. Not bad. Pretty cool. Pretty sweet indeed. Awesome. Make sure you guys thumbs up the video and make sure you check out tonight's video. Also, there's going to be a lot of deck techs coming your way. As always, PLA.